This is when it really matters. We've got someone running for president who's not only bullied people and made bigoted comments about everybody, but he is the only major party nominee for president in 40 years who hasn't released his tax returns. So he went nearly two decades without paying a dime toward our military, our veterans, our education, our health care, our highways, or anything else. I, I, I believe that most of us here have paid a lot more federal income taxes than Donald Trump has paid. And, and he claims he's worth $10 billion. Well, he also said that not paying taxes was smart. Well, some more information just came to light yesterday, and now we know that Donald Trump meant, when he says he was smart, for not paying his fair share. He meant that he used what the New York Times called, and I quote, a legally dubious scheme to avoid paying taxes. Even his own high-priced lawyers warned him it likely wouldn't fly with the IRS, and he took everything. He took everything our great country has to offer. He scooped it up with both hands and then paid nothing to support us. And then he has the nerve to call our military a disaster, to insult POWs when he hasn't paid a penny to support the people who put on the uniform of the United States of America. Now, with the election just seven days away, we should demand again that Donald Trump immediately release his tax returns. He has no excuse because his 2015 taxes are not even under audit. And I think the American people deserve to know whether he paid any penalty for skirting the law and how much he's actually worth and who he does business with. I'm particularly interested in the Russian business deals that he has. At the end of the day, Donald Trump is the poster boy for everything that's wrong with our economy. As you've heard, it was just announced on Friday that the FBI is reopening their investigation into the criminal and illegal conduct of Hillary Clinton. Hillary has nobody but herself to blame for her mounting legal problems.